Hey, what's up guys? This is Chris at WingSound.com. In this video, I'll show you how to customize your groups, which will help speed up your workflow in Logic Studio. Remember, you can always get in contact with me with any questions, comments, or ideas. Chris at WingSound.com. To open up a group, simply click on the blank button on your channel strip directly above the meter. Now, here are all of your groups that you have to choose from. I'm going to put it in group three. And now, if you click on the same button, scroll up to the top, you'll see Open Group Settings. Select that. Now, here is your Group Setting window that should pop right up. Basically, what this does is this is where you can customize your groups by any bots here that's checked off is going to be affected within the group. Meaning, if I select Pan and I try to pan one of the the channel strips within that group now all the channels within that group are going to work together whereas if I disable that it is now by itself same thing with any of this if I select channel strip color then anytime I change a color of a region within one of those tracks it's going to do the same if I disable it then now it's just each of those are by itself and you can also do the same thing for sends and all that. You can name the group if you want. Just going to name it group. Now you can see that group is now in the name for all of the channels within that group. And you can also just disable and re-enable it there again. And now you can quickly go back and forth between all the different groups that you have selected here by either scrolling down here and same thing there or by using the arrows back and forth make sure you follow wing sound on twitter and facebook to stay connected to a stream of new videos as well as cool music production links twitter.com slash wing sound or search for wing sound on facebook